All right, so now we're going to transition into another kind of kick. So we've gone through the little shin kick. We've gone through the front kick here. We're going to talk about roundhouses, where you calm across the body. Uh, again, Krav Maga, we hybridize, but we also adapt. We also change things slightly. With a traditional roundhouse, if G does a roundhouse for me on this leg here, you'll see it. Okay, he's using his instep. That's a traditional kick. Now, if he goes into a Thai roundhouse, less instep, more shin. The difference being, when you hit with the shin, it's very talky. You're driving your opponent away and you're following through with your hips. Traditional styles like karate and taekwondo are very snappy. They use the instep more. In Krav Maga, we take it to another level. We don't use the instep, we still use the shin, but we take our knee past the target. Whereas in Thai, you're here, we take our knee past the target. In effect, we're flailing round. The leg is swinging away from the target. So I'm not coming in to hit him here. I'm not coming to...